morning. It is Monday, May 20th. It is around 6 a.m. Um, I am just getting ready. Uh, we have our plane. We have to go uh, to the small airport in Jacques Mal to go taking a small plane from there to the big airport in Port-au-Prince. Um, and then we have our flight to Miami and then we have a long layover. So I'm just getting ready. I have to feed Avi. I have to, um, everything's packed. I just have to brush my teeth and then put my toothbrush away. Um, and then, um, but I gotta feed Avi right now. Um, he's fussing in his crib right now, so. Um, hey, well, what are you doing? You think you're coming? I don't think you are, honey. No, I don't think you are. Avi, qu'est-ce que tu fais? Qu'est-ce que tu fais? <laughs> Qu'est-ce que tu fais? So there's a driver downstairs. Um, I'm gonna go down and wait for Chris. Uh, why are you so cute, Abby? Um, but yeah, I'm a little nervous, but I know it's gonna be good. We're gonna be fine, right, Abby? It's just the first time flying with Abby. Um, new territory. Uh, Yep, so um, I'm going to nurse him on the plane because I heard that that's, they should be sucking on something, either his pacifier or my boob or a bottle, but uh, probably do boob um, because um, that way it won't hurt his ears when the pressure, so we're going to do that. Okay. The hardest part? of going out of town as much as I need sometimes to get away from Haiti is leaving the dogs. They're really part of our family and they love Avi. They're super sweet with him. They try to always give him kisses like this. Avi <laughs> gets a little bothered by it because their kisses are kind of slobbery. But they're so protective, so amazing. And I always miss them. You know, they're, they were my babies before Abby was with us, um, and especially Zeiss. I think I always loved Zeiss more than the rest of them because of how sweet and gentle he is. Good? Uh, the dogs are always bothering him, um, and Zeiss gets very jealous if I give too much attention to the other dogs. He doesn't get jealous of Avi, but the other dogs, definitely. Avi was pretty good on the plane, except that he started crying because his ears started to hurt. And it wasn't in the beginning or at the end, it was in the middle of the flight. Um, he started crying and pulling at his ears. Uh, it wasn't as bad as the second flight to LA though. That was really bad. Obvious with Chris's mom right now, so it gives me a chance to relax. What? 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 <laughs> um, yeah, so it gives me. So we're in Miami, we had some food. Our flight's tomorrow at 9 a.m., so we're just waiting for that. Um, I guess I don't know what we're gonna do with the rest of the day. Um, obvious with Chris's mom. Um, I think. Chris's brother is gonna come by later, so yeah. Got my package from Swanky Shink. Oh, look, come 
up. This is her Father's Day. Mm. You like it? Mm -hmm. Red like that. I did. So we're at the Miami airport. Um, we just went through security, so I think we're now we're gonna get some food because it's like 7:20 now and 7:22, 20, whatever, around 7:20. Um, and so I'm really hungry, so I think we're gonna get some food and then because our flight's not until nine, so let's do that. Right, Abby? And baby wearing is amazing. Makes life so much easier at the airport. The excitement I felt of finally arriving to LA was, uh, I can't even explain it. Um, I hadn't seen my family since Christmas 2017 because last Christmas I couldn't fly because I was very pregnant with Avi. So I couldn't fly. And so this is the first time I've been back and LA will always be my home. It is where I grew up my teenage years. It's a place I really want my son to get to know. It's where my brothers are, and I know that my brothers are going to be amazing with him, which is something that I'm really happy about. They're gonna be an amazing. Place. So we made it to LA. Um, had some issues with the car thing. A lot more than it was supposed to be, so. Just okay, simply. so we are on the drive through to go to In N Out. Um, Avi is sitting in the back, and I'm not for the first time ever. I've never sat in the back while Avi was in the car. I mean, in the front while Avi was in the car. I always love having In N Out, it always feels like I'm home once I have In N Out. Glorious, glorious in and out. So we arrived downtown LA and I saw my brother, I saw his girlfriend Aria, and then we decided to walk around and there's this museum that we went to and in the back for some reason they had chickens and these chickens were so big. It made me want to take some back to Haiti and have a little chicken coop even though my dogs are little murderous dogs and can't really have chickens. The chickens that I do have, they live next door in a different house because I can't have them around my dogs. But uh, they had beautiful chickens, they had plants. Um, <laughs> it was fun to walk around. And here's the thing you can follow. Taking care of your lens. There's a lot of spots on it. Oh, it's Mexican oregano, strong, pungent. Uh, yeah, this is crazy. There was something spicy in it, the, uh, the radish. Yeah, it's got a really nice kick to it. Mm. Both the flour and the bean. Ooh, radish is yeah, you can eat this. I think it's really good. Just numb it up. Mm -hmm. And then these little... Oh, Julia 
just said come to go get him tiger, which is oh, just there. Okay. Huh? And our first night in LA, Harley and Arya and Chris made dinner. Um, I was holding Avi because he wasn't asleep yet. The time change kind of messed up. Of our schedule and we didn't really have a routine in LA which was a little bit tough for us um, and then while we ate Avi was napping we nap on the couch so we are walking around it is we just had breakfast and now we're walking around the neighborhood. This is downtown LA. <laughs> Very <laughs> non naturey <laughs> Not what we're used to. So it is Thursday. Um, we're gonna have breakfast. Yesterday we went to the movies. We took Avi, and he actually slept through the whole thing. He's such a good baby. Um, right now, Chris is looking for where we're gonna go for food, and Avi's just chilling there. Avi, are you a good baby? What do you think? Are you a good baby? You're so cute. <laughs> Your little outfit. Your little ears. Yeah, little ears. Um, let's see what else. We saw Sue's baby yesterday. Um, we had, he was mostly asleep and then once Lily left, he woke up. So I really want to see him again and him actually being awake. Um, a little play date even though Henry doesn't really know what's going on yet in the world. Um, yeah, I know Avi, I know. 
Uh huh. Oh, you want to say something on YouTube? What do you want to say? Uh. Oh, really? What else? Oh, you got shy? You got camera shy? <laughs> He's like a little man, Chris. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no? You don't think so? Mm -hmm. Like the way he acts? Um, what are we going to do today? I don't think we have fun today. Do we? No, I don't think we have plans. We have plans tomorrow. So I don't know if I'm going to vlog that much today. Tomorrow I'm going to go to my old high school to see some my teach, my English teacher. She was my favorite teacher. One of my favorite teachers um, while there. Um, the other one doesn't work there anymore. So um, she actually only worked there when I was going to school. Um, Hey, Daddy, Mommy's hungry. Mm -hmm, so. Okay, put your shoes on then. Where are my shoes? Avi has his shoes. Mommy doesn't have her shoes. Oh, Mommy's shoes are here, but where's Daddy's shoes? So we are at a restaurant called Zinc, which is on the corner of my brother's house. Um, on my, yeah. Um, I ordered huevos rancheros today. Yesterday I ordered French toast. So, a little different. What did you order, baby? What did you order? A burrito. A burrito? And yeah, that's it. Um, and Abby's just sitting here. Hey, my love. You warm? You okay? Yeah? <laughs> oh, that smile. Oh, I love that smile. Yes, your smile warms my heart. Yeah, I love you. Huevos rancheros. Yum, yum, yum. Nobby. No fussy fuss. See, look, she's putting then for lunch, we went to this place called Squirrel that last time we were in LA with Chris, we wanted to go, but I suppose it was really busy and Harley and Aria took us to this place. It was really nice. The food was good. Um, it was not what I expected. I guess I expected this really nice place. Again. Oh, no, other, other way. Is that, is that nice? Other way? Yes. Day weekend because everyone's gonna be. 
I went to a very different kind of high school than most people. I went to a small high school called New Road School. They also have middle school and elementary, but I went there for high school for the last two years. So I went there as a junior, and it was the most am amazing experience. It was very open. Um, I was really able to be myself at that school, which is something that I never really felt. Before, I always felt like I didn't fit in at all the other schools that I went to. Right. Yeah, you have to check in. So, go. Turn. At my high school, I took a lot of film classes, and we were also very involved in social justice and the environment and really caring about the world in place. So, you really got a full education. So, you had all the cores. And then you had an environment class, and you had astronomy, and a lot of different things. And Hi, new roots. After going to New Roads and seeing my teachers and showing off Avi to my old teachers, I went to my best friend's house. Uh, she is Avi's godmother. We actually met at New Roads. Um, and we just hung out. She was able to spend some time. I hadn't seen her also since 2017 Christmas time. So it's also been a while. But every time we're together, it's like no time has passed at all. Um, and then we went out and we went to the Third Street Promenade, which is like a, a mall, but outside. And we went to Victoria's Secret. And then we also went to Sephora because she wanted, uh, Michaela wanted to get a lipstick. While we were out uh, uh, shopping, Avi fell asleep in his Sully wrap. I would have really loved um, the Sully wrap, but eventually it's going to be too big for him. But it's really useful when we're traveling. Yes, except I didn't do a very good job and I was wondering if you could help me fix it. <laughs> <laughs> and you and help me also teach me how to do it. Don't worry. Do you like the color on me? Or Girl, yes. Yeah. With the glasses yeah. and the frame, yeah. it works it together. So good. I said with the glasses. Yes. It matches. You did a terrible job and I look like a glass. A true friend is going to tell you yes or no. Oh. Yeah, that's true. That's my godson. <laughs> yeah, they're really best friends. <laughs> four months? Are we four months. Four, four months. months. He's teeny tiny. <laughs> yeah, normally I would push it for her, but my arm can't really go that way. <laughs> On Saturday, Chris and I went to Sue's. We walked around a bit, and then uh, we went to Venice so that... Uh, Harley's mom, Missy, could meet Avi and a friend of ours, Rebecca, and then Michaela came over as well. And then Chris and I and Avi walked to Venice Beach. I wanted to show Avi the Pacific Ocean. We are going to the beach. A baby. Mm -hmm. With our baby. And yeah, we're just walking now. What <laughs> the?
went to this waffle breakfast that um, my my brother's friends organizes so we went there and then we had a picnic in Elysian wow, Park yeah, and then we went to Michaela's house so that they could say goodbye to him since we were leaving two days after that and on Tuesday my brother was coming in Eli from Berkeley with his mother to we are at a taco Chris place. and Abby. Hey Abby. <laughs> um, we're gonna have some tacos I don't know what this is exactly, but we'll see. Yeah. Okay, let's try it. I loved being in LA and seeing Avi with different people, seeing him meet all the important people in my life that have had a real impact of how I was raised, <laughs> seeing Sue, seeing um, Harley with Avi, seeing all these people with Avi. And I think my favorite part was really seeing my brothers with Avi. And I can't wait until I go to LA for Christmas for Avi's first Christmas. And he's going to be mm -hmm. so much more grown by then. But I love seeing my brothers with um, Avi and how they interacted with him. And Avi is very lucky to have both my brothers as, their, as his uncles.